Good morning, everyone. This is Sunday. Um, typically, we cook breakfast every morning anyways. Um, I know that's kind of countercultural <laughs> uh, and different from the way that we grew up as well. But um, I do cook breakfast every morning, and especially on Saturday, Sunday mornings, we do kind of a big a big thing um, a little more detailed so Stella helped me with muffins which I'll show you in a second and because they're still in the oven um, I've cooked some of our sausage it's kind of dark so you might not be able to see very good and um, and then I've been kind of concerned that we haven't we haven't really been eating a lot of greens lately um, so I harvested some of our older kale the other day and I'm gonna put this in our sausage um, and then put some eggs with it and cook that together um, probably put some feta on top or um, some of our little one or at least Sydney doesn't like um, feta as much so she might use some Parmesan or something on hers but and um sunday's just a really good relaxing day around here we typically sit around and read a lot um take some walks uh, it's gonna be a really nice day so i will take you guys outside with us as we walk around some and um and play cards and stuff like that so what do you guys do on Sundays? Do you take a rest? Do you take a Sabbath? Uh, we've tried to be way more intentional about that lately, and I'm just curious to see what you guys do. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Are you apologizing for skipping her? Yep. Tell us what you're doing. Thank you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> when you get okay, done, tell us what good. you're doing. <laughs> okay. Ooh, dirty, dirty fella. Mm. Well, I'm trying to uh, capture the water that hits this land up on this side by um, making it run down this line right here. So this is a, a contour line, and this tool is called an A-frame level. And you just um, start at a point where I wanted the water to come out, 
and then you just keep rotating this thing and it finds the level line all the way down a contour so the land slopes like this and so the, the level line kind of meanders through the slope if that makes any sense so you can see all the stakes are the same height above sea level at each stake so I can start a either a ditch I can take the tractor and the plow and plow a ditch down this line or I can take some dirt and mound it up behind it or mulch and when the water hits this line it'll flow that way instead of straight downhill mm -hmm. That's any neat. other questions no it's just I've never seen that before oh I did it before but I started over here oh but I I didn't have enough stakes at that point to go all the way out and I just gave up. I just I haven't done it since. Yeah. So you just take this, once you have your mark there, just move it over here to the other side of it. Like this. And, the, and a string with a weight on it is always plumb because of gravity. And so you get it plumb and mark a line on it and then as you're doing this you just turn this until the string lines up with the mark that you have and it's always straight up and down see this land is sloping that way and so this line is going to curve way back around this way to stay level okay you could do this forever like if our driveway wasn't there I could go all the way around this hillside and capture the water on the whole hillside and make it run around around the slope instead of straight down it it's pretty cool isn't it yeah you can buy fancy tools to do this with <laughs> like a, a transit like that thing we were using oh, out yeah. at the, it, uh -huh. it just you're finding the level line across there. right it's the same thing this was this was a free tool yeah <laughs> he's over here farting while he's crawling around <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. It could be down the hill and go straight across, but it has to be built up. Uh huh. Or the ditch has to be deeper. Yeah. It'll have to be deeper down on that end. If I move downhill here. Yeah. The thing about this, since this is just a little small area, I could probably come up here and start it. Mm hmm. It's just going to run fast right here. Yeah. Do you think it'll run? Like if it runs too fast, will it break off of the the line that you? It will erode it. Uh huh. You want it to run a little bit, so yeah, that's level, and so I really want this end to be a little bit higher than that end. Yeah. I'll do the same thing out in the pasture. I'll go down below this line a little bit and mark it, trying to go back up into the hill some. Okay. So it runs back uphill, sort of. You know, and mm -hmm. slowly goes down in the pasture. Gradually goes down into the ground. Yeah. Yeah. I can show you out here in the woods where our ancestors did the same thing. Okay. I was watching it the other day while it was raining. Yeah. You want to go see that? Sure. I'm sure you've noticed these berms right here, haven't you? Yeah. The, the hillside. Uh huh. Well, they made these with a tractor. Okay. They took it something and drug dirt up and made these mounds basically, but it's a berm. And it's like a, a gutter that catches all the water on this hillside. And I was watching it the other day. It was coming down and it would get right here and run out because we've been driving down through here. Oh yeah. And so I'm gonna take it and fix this where it continues to go down. It'll go around that berm and, and slowly dissipate in the woods back there. Okay. But I'm going to take it where it goes around 
dissipates and then comes back down to another one that comes this way. Mm. So it's kind of back and forth down the hill. Okay. But this goes probably, I'm gonna say 600 yards up there, around, all the way around the woods. Hmm. So it's catching all that water off the hill and bringing it down slowly. Cool. But that's why our soils are so fertile. Yeah. Because it's, it's been doing that for a hundred years. Yeah. That's neat. Takes, takes some planning and then... Yeah. So this area right here, because we've been driving through here while we're working on the house, it's broken this and water's running out right there. You can see where it's eroding away where we've been driving. So I'm going to take the tractor and burn this up again. I don't know. <laughs> Can you grab me? <laughs> you get out here in the woods and mark something. <laughs> what are you doing? Sweet. Mm. All right. See right here where all that water was running from way up there and running out right here. Uh huh. Which is fine. I mean, it's slowly going down through the leaves. But I want to take it and wrap it around the hill a little bit. And then go down there. There's another one that they made down the hill and bring the water back this way. Mm -hmm. Usually do this. <laughs> 